Welcome again to uh, Bottle Making Maniacs. I'm Charlie. And I'm Ray. We're just going to quickly go through um, the uh, flight simulator that we've got here that we purchased from Banggood and some of the connections and pieces that you get with it and uh, a really nice way of connecting it up to the to the actual computer so that you can use your uh, FlySky transmitter and you don't have to have it actually plugged into the uh, into the computer, don't have to get it wired in. So, what about this this um, this unit here? Yeah, it's a good setup. It's um, as Charlie said, from Banggood. It comes with everything you need, including the software in there. But yeah. we did find that sometimes the software on the CD is a bit dodgy. That's right. Um, the one we use is the Phoenix RC, yeah. and that is now available for free on the internet because okay. it's classed as abandoned wear. So yep. we'll have links in the description for all this stuff. For sure. So you can download that software if the CD doesn't work when you get it from uh, from Banggood. Right? And it's also got the upgrade on there to go to version 6. Okay. So yeah, it's great. Yeah. But right. what you get in the box, in this the box? is the main bit. So you get a, a dongle. You can't run the flight simulator without the dongle. Uh, you also get uh, some cables. So to connect to connect this one directly to your FlySky transmitter is simply into the dongle and then into this little guy here, which is the, is it S-Video uh, connection? Yes, S-Video. It does give you another one if you have a different type of transmitter. I'm not too sure what that one's for, but we don't use that we one. We don't use that one. So, so. so with the S-Video, you can plug that into the back of your uh, transmitter, FlySky transmitter, and then the dongle has a USB connection that goes into your computer. And away you go. And then, yeah, effectively, you just need to set this up on the computer, get it to recognize um, recognize the transmitter, and then it just works by itself. So that's really cool. Now, the other cable that comes with it is this one, which has got the little servo connector. Yep. Now, with the receivers for the FlySky, there's two types. You get the IA6 and then the IA6B. Yep. This is your basic standard receiver. If you've only got something like this at home, you have to physically yep. plug the you'll need to transmitter use, with the you'll need to that use cable into the dongle. Cables, right? If you have the, the, B type. the B type, yep. channel one has marked on it PPM. So what you can do now is you just plug that into channel one into the dongle. dongle, plug it into your laptop, and make sure your receiver is bound to your transmitter, and now you can walk away, sit across the room if you want, and fly your flight sim. And so. of course, um, we normally set up on the FlySky, one of the models is set up, and we've I've called mine sim underscore RC, but then you've got a dedicated model uh, that will be um, bound to that particular receiver, and that receiver will be set up on the uh, on the yep. on the uh, on the software on the uh, flight sim software yep. Phoenix. Phoenix. So software. what we'll do is we'll just plug this in. We'll just do a quick show of the cordless sure, sure. setup on it. Yep. I've already got the um, the transmitter set up for Sim RC, and now that the sure, receiver's yeah. plugged in, that's come up on the screen, and Could I can see what's going on. Grab the camera, and we'll just do that. And we're live with that one, so we'll... I don't know how close I have to have this, but... We'll yeah, about there, I think we'll probably there. be okay. Yeah. Yep. yeah. Let's turn some volume up. And he's flying his... Okay. Well, he's flying my P51 Mustang. So, the, so there's a P51 Mustang on there. And you have can to watch see, the other videos to get that one. You can see yeah. now that we haven't got anything connected to the... Uh, anything connected to this, so... Yep. I'll be happy to... And we're away. Not a bad little flight simulator, this. We'll just do a quick roll here. Oh, look out, I'm about to crash. Yes. That was terrible. That was the worst roll ever. Thank you. Cool. Okay. And I think we're nearly there. That's it. Let me just land it, okay? And what we'll do, we'll, we'll do another a video after this. Uh, well, you live up to your nickname, Crash. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, thanks. <laughs> That's all right. We'll, we'll do another video after this on how to set the FlySky transmitter up on the on the uh, Phoenix flight sim. But this is a really good flight sim. It's, it's yeah. great fun. Yeah. Um, and they've also got their online channel open. So 
You yeah. can actually play online. Yeah. I can set up a session and Charlie can join in and the other guys can find it and just join and we can all fly together. Yeah. Not having to meet up, we can do it all online. It's pretty exciting, yeah. Competitions, yeah. it's good fun. We'll show you some of that in the next video, but this is a really good flight sim, especially when you can get it for nothing. So yeah, yeah, no, that's very great, good. Great fun, great yep. fun. All right, all right. I think that's it for now, and uh, we'll catch you later. All right. Cheers. Bye.